Hey guys, I recently bought a time capsule, the 3 terabyte one, and even though it was double boxed, when I opened it, I found that the original box was pretty beat up. As you can see, even this corner looks like it was dropped many times before being packaged. Um, so what I did is that I tested it with the computer and I had the um, uh, orange blinking light. The functionalities of the airport um, and the wireless were fine but it couldn't find the drive and I kept getting the um, drive error that many of you maybe know. So what I decided to do, I decided to open it. It's fairly simple. Uh, it's a very, very cool design, very tight. Uh, there are no screws whatsoever. Um, and what I decided is I decided to open it from this side. So you need one tool, one of these kind of tools. Comes right up. So you can see, you can see the SATA connector and the two antennas. This is the power. This is the plate that holds the um, drive in place. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna lift this. There is nothing that is holding it in place. Then I'm gonna use this um, T8. Now the plate is off. Now what we have is the SATA connector that is a pull up. The two antennas instead pull out, pull toward you. So I don't know if you can see it, but this wire here, this way, and then the other connector came out, and then the SATA connector. Here you go. Now what we have here is just the gasket for protection. And now you see this is the SATA connector for the hard drive. There you go. Now the drive is free. It's pretty tight, but it's free. There is something like compression at the bottom. But what you do, just put it upside down a little bit. You try, you play with it a little bit. You try to get it out. Here you go. So this, you can see how it looks inside. There's nothing that was holding it in place. It's a Barracuda, three terabyte. Uh, what I did is that I tested it on one of my test station and it, it just wasn't coming up, it was just ticking. So what you do is just buy another drive, another SATA drive, you replace it, you start over, you just put everything back together and you go in the airport functions and um, it allows you to rebuild the drive and you're ready to go.